What's up guys? Just got off the flight. This is the coldest jet bridge I think I've been on. I had to check my bag. Under the plane, which always sucks. Especially at this cold temperature, throwing the cameras underneath the plane. I've been coming to Minneapolis for a while just to connect her to uh, while I'm traveling. And what's cool is uh, they've just got this new restaurant in here. And there's Kirby Puckett behind me. Watched him uh, when I was a kid, absolutely loved it. And uh, I actually bought his rookie card last year um, just because it was something like that I always wanted to have when I was a kid and I finally was able just to be able to get it. Even though I'm obviously not following him anymore because he's since passed, but anyway, super cool to be able to be here and uh, just reflect back on being a kid. Landed in Baltimore, Maryland. It is 12:21 tonight. It's late. I'm gonna rent a car. I'm going to then drive an hour and 40 minutes to Virginia. Anyway, it should be an interesting trip. And look what I found right there behind me. There's actually two: one here and one on the other side. So already Baltimore has shown that they got carts. Because again, it's better than paying for them. Not only am I getting an upgraded vehicle, because it's so dang late, but also, it's awesome. He said, he's like, oh dang, you got a bunch of bags? Like, let me bring the car to you. So I'm like, sweet. Man, this is one busy airport. Uh, anyway, finally got my rental car, and it's now saying, look at this. Arriving at 3.05 a.m. Ooh, it's gonna be a long night. Now I knew that I had to stop, and get something to either eat. It's like 1.45 a.m. I don't normally do this, but I gotta make sure I'm gonna be safe tonight. I'm not gonna get into like after three now. Probably gonna be four. Windows are fogging up. It's always hard being on the East Coast where I'm not used to humidity and anyway. All right, you guys, I made it safe and uh, I am here at this beautiful dental practice with Dr. Alexis and uh, anyway, it's just really cool to, to be here. Uh, just finished actually doing the 360 scan. You can see all those dots. Now we're gonna move on to doing the interviews and just documenting this beautiful, beautiful practice. For 2017, we did a million dollars, over a million dollars in production. I want to say last spring I shut down the advertising because I, I couldn't, we couldn't handle it anymore. All right, so the interview just wrapped up. I'm going to start breaking all this stuff down. Um, went really well. It's, in, it's an interesting process, like trying to capture someone's story. And it's so cool because I actually get to know people uh, at just a different level than I would if I just came in, you know. So it's just, I don't know, I'm like super fortunate to be able to to be able to spend the time to interview people and to hear their stories. It's just, anyway, I love it. So just had an amazing dinner with Dr. M and his wife Lisa, and now he is taking me out for a spin in his new Tesla. So this is gonna be pretty fun. Yeah, I like it. <laughs> <laughs> now you do this while it's self-driving, right? <laughs> yes. Just, yes you do. just when you need to take a note. That's right. That's awesome. <laughs> All right, you guys, just wrapped up with Dr. M. It's been years since I've seen him last, but it's been awesome to be able to hang out together. We just finished a scan of his dental practice. That is a new record for me, two in one day. And uh, anyway, it's been fun hanging out with Dr. M, getting caught back up, 
and uh, I just appreciate him. And anyway, thanks for having me. And hey, this is a lot of fun. This is amazing. Brandon is an awesome guy, and he's doing a great job with this. Thanks a lot.